Hey guys, welcome back to today's video. So today I thought I'd film a what is on my iPhone type of video. I really like um, watching these types of videos, so I thought I'd do one myself. It's taken me all morning to try and get like the software um, to sort it out, but I think we're getting there. So if there's a little bit of a gap between the video and my voice, I do apologise um, because the editing software I've got or the filming software isn't the best. Um, but it's as good as we're gonna get so let's just go ahead and see how we do so if any of you are wondering I have the iPhone 6s rose gold 64 gigabytes I've had this only about a month um, just over a month actually um, I got it a couple of weeks just before my birthday and I absolutely love it so as you um, so on my home screen I have a photo of me and my boyfriend and then I'm going to open it. I have all the usual apps that you would normally have on an iPhone on my um, front screen. Apart from the London Midlands train app. Because I use that on a daily basis when I'm at college. To find out when my train is to get home. Um, and then down the bottom I just have phone, messenger, Spotify and Noom Coach. Which is like a diet. Not a diet but like a tracking calorie app. But I never really use it anymore. Um, and then I have an extra folder which has just usual junk stuff in apart from Save a Life which is a defibrillator app where you can find the nearest defibrillator in case someone's having a heart attack or a cardiac arrest. So I feel like this is a really good app to have if you're going somewhere new and someone in the streets just drop down dead um, and you can go and find the nearest defibrillator. And then I've got two period tracking apps and a Tesco My Mobile app. And then I have Facebook Messenger, WhatsApp, Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest, YouTube, Amazon, Outlook, um, Barclays, Google Photos, AA, um, Amazon, um, Angry Birds 2, Candy Crush, Candy Crush, so Jelly, um, Candy Crush Normal One, Jelly Splash, 1010, Flow Free, um, Solitaire, Cleared, Cleared, whatever that one is this one um which i don't really use very often and mer merged merged and then i have the timetable app i'm having to look down at my computer if you're wondering why why i'm looking all over the place um because it seems to be a little bit funny this app um <laughs> this program that i'm using and then it's learning is the app we have for college kahoot is just a game we play at college um the one next door to it don't know even why I have it on there because I never use it. National Rail, which I don't tend to use as much, but because I have the Amazon Echo, it's useful to have. Um, Aruba Buses, Dictionary, because I'm severely dyslexic. The Taxi People, to find out if I ever needed a taxi, which I don't normally get a taxi anywhere. Um, Eight Ball Pool, which I never use. X Factor, again, never really used. Theory test because I'm learning to drive. Kitchen stories, which is actually quite a good app. I'm not going to open it because my laptop doesn't like it. Um, but it's a really good app for like cooking and um, if I can open it, I might have to do this separately. Um, and it tells you lots of different like recipes and you can put in your favourite recipes. Um, time hoop, um, Eva pick, wallpapers, BBC iPlayer, Skype, and then an editing software for uh instagram color dope um the center mk app which i downloaded to see if they had a yankee candle and then mini mini tomo mini mini me um uni days is the really good app if you're a student definitely go and check it out you can get discounts um and that's how i managed to pay for my macbook because i got a student discount google um nhs tracking app weight app um layout for instagram uh feedback i have on my phone because i have like the beta software on my phone and if you download the beta software you end up getting the feedback app uh the westfield uk app Free prints and photo books is quite a good app actually. All you have to do, you get 30 prints free a month and all you have to do is pay for the postage 
which I actually really like because I like to have photos printed, but it can be quite expensive to do it at home. Theory free, theory free, theory test, theory test. I have quite a few theory tests on my phone. Tiny Scanner, which is actually a really good app. Um, if you have like a document and you need to scan it in, or need to send it in an email you can just use this app and scan it studios to check on how my youtube videos are doing um nus extra is another student discount app capture is for if i want to vlog on my phone i can do chrome pit collet collage college collage asos apple store ebay superdrug find my dupe liquor so um if like my mini me i don't know if this is going to kill all my software but you can find out who you look like um and it just give blood because i've just signed up to um give blood because i feel like it's a really important thing to do so i've got that to find out when like where i can go for that and when they are um project toe i'm not entirely sure what that is um zeke and then another weighing app, Google Photo Editor, uh, the Creator Cloud, the Creator for like Zoe Sug and all their like products, which I had to like my hoodie still haven't come, which I'm really disappointed about. Um, Argos, Mario Run, uh, Canon, the Camera Canon app, because I have a Canon camera, uh, New York Parking Free Truck Park um subscribe account my alexa app um ask alexa she just went off then oops um disney crossing road matchsticks i cloud drive flipagram audiobook pro recorder and stu student which links up with the editing software that i'm using so that's about it there's not really that much that many interesting things on my phone um so that's my phone it's a little bit random let me know if there's any good apps i should download in the comment box down below if you've liked this video give it a thumbs up oh i'm going on to barclays um give it a thumbs up and i hope to see you very soon for another video bye guys